Hey guys, this is um, an update, well not really, it's, well actually yeah it is, this is a, well it's supposed to be a 20 gallon, which I bought from a, from Kijiji, an auction thing in Canada, well yeah, um, it was supposed to be a 20 gallon, but you know, when I went there and saw it, it was actually just a 10 gallon, because, I don't know, I, I when I got there I already knew it was already a, like a 10 gallon or something, or something close to that, because it did not look like a 20 gallon to me. And then when I got home, I checked, it was actually 10 gallon. But it was still pretty cheap, it was like $30. Yeah, and yeah, I set it up, it's been like three weeks now. I sped up the cycling and everything by using like old water for, uh, from my other tanks. Uh, I added, I just recently added these plants. I forgot what they're called, but they make the tank look really nice. And sorry for the quality, um, I'm using my Blackberry here. <laughs> I think it's that good. I didn't uh, try it and upload it to my computer yet, but yeah. Um, I also got two um, two angelfish. They're platinum in color. I, I don't know. I love their color. I know this is a kind of small tank for them, but I'm gonna when they grow bigger, I'm gonna move them into a bigger tank. I just like they look really nice. Here you go. Oh, they're really shy. I just put them in like a, an hour ago or something. Yeah, um, I added two huge pots in there. They were originally for my um, Garbenses, but you know, I added a lot of like I added angelfish, and I really liked them. <laughs> and I tried putting my Garbenses, one of them, the female, but it kept you know kept attacking them, so I moved them to the other tank. And the guppies I had since they were fries a long time ago from the 30 gallon them in here. I don't know, it looks really nice to me. There it is. And I'm gonna go to my other 10 gallon over here. And I don't know, I don't like the setup for this one. It looks really bad. But I don't have enough money to <laughs> make it look better. Uh, I don't really have much in here. Well, actually I have a lot in here. I have like the rose barons and the, the minnow. I put three Kareb benzes here. It's it's just for temporary because um, my other 30 gallon tank, well my other th my th uh, other tank, um, the two crevices paired up. I don't want them to get hurt, so I moved them to this tank. Yep, this tank looks really nasty. <laughs> There's some rocks. I tried piling the rocks up together to make caves and stuff for them. Make them look, you know, territorial. They don't really attack each other. It's like two female and one male, but they occasionally chase after each other. Yep. And I still have my loaches. It's been a long time already. They used to be in my 30 gallon. But they were attacking my other fish. My pleco, actually. And my quarry is over there for my 30 gallon, also. Moved a lot of fish in here because you know, I'm going to eventually move these some of these fish into the other 10 gallon. Because, but that one, since, since it's a new tank, I didn't want to move that much fish in there. Yeah. Oh, and there's also Pleco in there, I forgot to tell you again. It's in there somewhere. Yep. Here's my Pleco from my other 30 gallon. So now I'm going to go to my 30 gallon, which is over here. Uh, nothing changed, except the fact that I moved almost every fish out of there, except the Pleco, the Plecos, the Brissonos, and the normal Pleco behind there. Still really big. Yeah, I got one little fry in here. I just, I don't know, I saved it from being eaten. Uh, yeah, these two have been paired up. And, but then, I don't know, uh, it's been like a week or so, or half a week. No, it's been a week. And, yeah, they occasionally, like, try to get each other, like, shake. <laughs> Nothing really happens, though. But, you know, the male's pretty, still pretty young. The weirdest part is the male is smaller than the female, and the female still went after him. Yeah, yeah. My other, I moved the other cabrances because yeah, these two were attacking. They were teaming up on all of them, so yeah, I didn't want to make them. Yeah, hurt. So I just moved them. Uh, this tank is really bare now. It's only like two cabrances and three plecos. I don't know. The setup is not that nice either. I don't really like it because of the gravel. I really want to change them, but it costs too much. Uh, 
Yeah, other than that, I have a lot of fake lines in here. I don't want new, because I don't have the hood, the light hood, the, actually the hood for it. So, if I put real plans in here, they'll die in like a matter of like weeks, which I tried, you know, I added like a lot of life uh, plans before, as you, if you've been watching my old videos, but they all died because they didn't have enough light, if not the right light. Yep, here's one of my, my vinyls, and my pair. I, I just really want them to breed. They look really nice. <laughs> Thanks for watching.